Salam alaikum. My name is Sarah Hepp and I'm the director of the MENA Climate and Energy Project of the German Friedrich Ebert Foundation. We are here at COP26 in Glasgow, which was officially opened now. And we want to take you with us for the next two weeks into the world of COP26. And today we already want to start with a little impression here. In the coming days, we will take a closer look at the MENA region and have different uh, interview partners with us um, because the MENA region is uh, a region that is um, most affected by the impacts of climate change. So embark with us on this journey. So COP26, it's the conference of the party under the UNFCCC, where government officials, heads of delegations and civil society come to discuss the Paris Agreement. Why is this a very important COP? Because we haven't been meeting for two years due to COVID and this is where we need to discuss Paris Agreement and we need to make it happen because if we don't, we're too late to save our planet. So this is the year of make it or break it. Wish us luck. Thank you. 26 is a very important COP for, for every country in, in, in the whole world. Well, within this COP, we are looking forward you know, for the uh, raising of the ambitions of countries and also raising the commitment within the climate finance all over. And the third pillar is the most important, which is sharing technology and lessons learned. Well, Jordan, among the developing country, is committed to uh, its NDCs, which have been doubled than the previous NDCs. And also, we are planning to, to be within this COP in the best way that we can, we can secure our development within a, a, a very low and decreased emissions in the future. 